Immersive virtual reality photos of multi-layer scene representation are the most prominent data structure to support a wide viewing range under full motion parallax. Layers ordered in diopter space partly contain encoded colors and transparency at the depth so that when stacked, the scene completes. Same as in conventional photos, once baked, it is challenging to remove obstructive objects. Although erasing occluding pixels might successfully reveal the background pixels, unobserved areas inevitably expose blank pixels. An existing CNN-based approach assumes a different use case to inpaint the background, and thus, often fails to complete the holes. This is where our work shines at. We present a two-step pipeline to remove objects from multi-layer scenes altogether. We first implement an interactive labeling tool to segment the visible frontal objects. Then, we apply a multi-layer image inpainting algorithm to fill in the remaining holes. Since we are the first to tackle this problem, we implemented multiple solutions to utilize conventional image inpainting algorithms to remove objects in the final multi-layer scenes. The simplest approach finds patches that take the minimum sum of squared differences and merges the patches to synthesize the missing pixels in the multi-layer image. The next approach finds the normal patches as well as the flipped versions so that available patch variations increase. The third approach compensates for differences in patch intensities when searching for the best matching patches. The last approach uses the previous two patch metrics in combination. We also implemented two multi-view inpainting approach where each multi-view image is inpainted and then converted into a multi-layer image. We applied two successful inpainting algorithms for this pipeline. Deep Fill V2 and Photoshop Content Aware Fill. Finally, we implemented an inpainting algorithm that applies patch match to each RGB alpha channel layer of a multi-layer image. Our series of evaluations, including a user study, validated the effectiveness of our approach in comparison to those solutions. Since our algorithm performs inpainting directly in input multi-layer scene representation, inpainted data can be seen in a VR headset as the original data. Here, we show the original, masked, and inpainted multi-layer data in three scenes in a sequence.